Hey guys, what's up? This is Shukesh once again. Today in this very special video, I will be comparing the on-screen fingerprint scanner of the new Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus with the finger scanner of the OnePlus 60. Now the new Samsung flagship utilizes the all-new Qualcomm Snapdragon Sense ID 3D fingerprint technology which works even when the screen is off because there is no need of light. The fingerprint is scanned by using very high frequency ultrasonic sound and it works just fine. It also works when your hand is wet or greasy. According to Qualcomm, it's faster than optical sensor and also more secure because it records a 3D image which is difficult to forge or full than a 2D photo that is recorded in the optical sensor of the OnePlus 60. With the help of the ambient sensor, you can quickly place the finger scanner area on the screen and it works just fine actually, but I'd go for the ultrasonic sensor on the Samsung flagship any day. Let's quickly do a quick speed test. When the screen is off, as you know, it doesn't work on the OnePlus 60. You have to tap or lift up the phone for the ambient display. So when the screen is off, definitely the Samsung device is faster. Not technically, but as a whole, the process is faster on the S10 Plus. Now let's quickly compare the actual sensor reading time. So let's turn on both the displays and well, the optical reader on the OnePlus 60 works faster. All the settings, all the animation scales are at the default settings and beyond any doubt, OnePlus 60 beats the S10 Plus as far as the fingerprint scanner speed is concerned. Let's quickly switch hands and give it another try. There you go, OnePlus 60 is definitely much faster. In fact, back in the days of hardware capacitive sensors, OnePlus phones were faster than most of the Android phones. Now in this new era of on-screen sensors, OnePlus is keeping its promise, it's lag-free, it's faster and kudos to OnePlus for such an amazing device at this price point. But definitely the future devices will have the ultrasonic sensor which is more advanced, accurate and secure and it also works perfectly at night and also in bright daylight. At first you might find it difficult to find the sensor on the screen but once you get used to, it works like a charm. That's all in this video. Thank you for watching. Subscribe and keep in touch.